Hey, you. The old man is waiting for you upstairs. This entrance to the building is off limits. You have to use the staircase. The old man's waiting. So, it's true what they say. You do have some kind of defect. Oh, it's good to see you, my boy. Leave us. I want to talk to him in private. You have to excuse me for not getting up. I'm in a rather unfortunate state. You did exceptional work at the bank. I want you to know that I am deeply grateful for your service to OCP and the city of Detroit. See? I grew up in this very apartment, or what's left of it. It used to be a thriving neighborhood, nothing like what you see right now. I always dreamt of turning it into the most prosperous district in the city, a new heart of Detroit. Can you imagine? Or do you think it's just an old fool's pipe dream? My purpose is to fight crime, not to make statements. No, of course not. Delta City's construction is about to start. Finally, the old and frail will be replaced. Decay and death are terrible things. You lose everything you worked for your entire life. But I don't have to tell you what that's like. It really makes me wonder. Has the time you spent in that armor been a burden to you? The only burden it causes is to criminal scum. I admire your confidence. The real reason I've summoned you here is because I'm worried. I'm aware of your instability problems. And it's not a matter that we can overlook. That's why I've requested to have people look after you. Tell me, how are you finding your evaluations with Dr. Blanche? I am happy to comply with any activity that improves effectiveness. You're a good sport. I can imagine it's not a pleasant experience, but I can't express how much I'd like you to keep at it. I'm sure that becoming a liability is the last thing you'd want. Am I right? That is correct. Now we've reached an understanding. Tell me, is there anything I could do to put your mind at ease? My fellow officers worry about OCP's intention regarding their work. Really? I'll have a word with Becker. Perhaps some new equipment would boost their morale. It would be appreciated. I have to say, you brought a lot of hope into this old man's heart. Now, excuse me. I'm not supposed to exert... Take care of yourself. After all, the peace of Detroit depends on your wealth. Oh. Holy shit! What was that? Robocop. Not such a piece of junk after all. Hey Murphy, are you done with the old man's tea party? Remember to get back in touch with your informer. See if he has any info that can get us back on the biker's lead. Spike is still out there. OCP wants to raise towers and glass and steel. Go on out. She's not going to
Greetings. Waiting for the movie screening. Just browsing to find which movie would most enhance my nuke experience. Has working with the police not made you change your ways? I need to keep up appearances. Now, nah, tell me. What's the next job for the police's finest duo? I need information on Spike's whereabouts. That SOB. I'll never forgive him for what he did to Briggs. Luckily, there ain't much left of the street vultures after the bank heist. They're probably laying low. But now you mention it, I heard about a biker who had a crash near the riverbank just behind the mart. So, your best bet is to check out the scene of the accident, or maybe hit up a nearby mechanic to see if they know anything. Any witnesses? Ah, uh, there's this crazy old bum who hangs out around there. He's nosy. You really want justice for Briggs? We owe him. But it's more about Daniel and Gay, and I think everyone will sleep better once those butchers are taken care of. Are you positive that he escaped on the damaged motorcycle? <laughs> Not so much on it as with it. From what I gathered, the bike suffered more than just a dent. I'm guessing he must have dragged it to some nearby mechanic to get it back in shape. Thank you. You have given me all I need. I, I know you're busy, but there's something that I need your help with. I will not be involved in any illegal... <laughs> That's very presumptuous of you. I just need help the titles. So what do you say? Will you help me look for it? If it helps you stay out of trouble, let us proceed. Yeah, it'll solve all my problems. Let's go! What are you looking for? So there's this movie about a guy with a gun, and there's this bad guy who wants something. I'm pretty sure the title has some biblical reference in it. You lack vital information on the subject. Okay, let's start searching. Remember, the title has something to do with the Bible, saints, uh, cosmos. Let's start by checking the thriller and drama sections. Should we ask the owner? <laughs> Forget him. He has no idea about movies. He thinks that Salamanca deserved the golden piston for the best picture. I heard that, and it did. Kind Shepherd? Love that one. You know that movie could have never happened. The director threw out the script after reading a couple of pages. Thankfully, his wife picked it out of the trash, and after reading it, she forced her husband to give it another look. Everyone deserves a second chance. Do we? I'm not so... Alex Murphy was given a second chance. But he... I mean, you really deserved it. It's just something... Anyway, I don't want to spoil the mood, but... <laughs> Garden of Earthly Delights. Oh man, great movie. Very elegant. Panned by the critics, though. But the director is a bad... We do not need to bow to how easier said than done, my man. Do not give in to the pressure. Are you... pressuring me? That's smart. It's gonna work. I feel it. But let's get back to it, because that's not our take. Nothing in thriller or drama. Okay. How about you check in the sci-fi and action section? I'll have a look at horror. Eve's Flower. Beautiful depiction of violence in that one. 
Do you think violence can be beautiful? It's just shown with a different sensibility to what we use. You know how they are. It's different. I it's cool, is all I'm saying. Recognizing beauty in something ugly is a unique feature. <sighs> Doesn't pay the bills, though. Then again, I don't have bills to pay anyway. Tax avoidance is a serious crime. That it is, but... Celestial Decay? Classic. But he said that if he ever did, he'd do it sequels, remakes, comic book adaptations, etc. They give hope that there is more. Yeah. Plus, you get to meet the characters you liked again. That's why I don't hate them. Anyway, risking to sound like a broken record, that's not the tape we're looking for. Hey, I think I found it. I messed up the title a little. It's called Me, Sire, but here it is. <sighs> Isn't that the tape we're looking for? <clears throat> tape? <clears throat> what? What tape? You like movies? Do you want to shoot an action movie? I, I think I'll wait till it comes out on VHS. Lights, camera, action! <laughs> Crap! I need a hand over here! Do you need assistance? Let's give him a warning! <laughs> <laughs> First, I hear a bunch of movie puns. Where is Pickles? He ran out the back door. Where will I find him? I don't know. By uh, homeless or not? Try the computer. Maybe you'll find something there. gonna pay for all this. Thank mm -hmm. you.
All right. Talk. Ah, uh, I overheard some torchhead saying that they were running away from the cops and went through that video store. They had a wad of drug money on them and didn't want the cops taking it, so they hid it in one of the VHS cases. I misheard the title, so I needed help. That is not the kind of help I was willing to provide. Come on, give me a break. I, I fucked up, I know. And I get that you're on a mission to save my life or something. With all that great advice of yours, just don't give in to pressure. That's a stellar one, dude, but excuse me if I don't comply, all right? There's just one thing that I need right now. Which is? All I need right now is a fix. So, let me keep the money. You won't hear me asking about anything else. Are you asking a police officer to leave you with money from Nuke Distribution? I know you're a police officer first, but can't you be a friend this one fucking time? I am not doing this as a police officer. I am doing it as a friend. Hand over the case. You, you can't do this to me, man. I just did. Fuck you, Tin Man. I earned that money fair and square.